Artificial intelligence, or AI, has been a topic of science fiction for decades. But in recent years, it has become a reality. Today, AI is everywhere, from smartphones to self-driving cars. And as this technology continues to evolve, it will revolutionize the way we live and work. The potential for AI is limitless. Researchers around the world are working on developing robots that can learn and adapt to new situations, perform complex surgeries, and even explore oceans and space. Self-driving cars are just the beginning. Soon, AI will be integrated into every aspect of transportation, from air traffic control to shipping logistics. AI-powered virtual assistant like Siri and Alexa are already changing the way we interact with technology, in future these assistant will only get more intelligent, anticipating our needs and making our lives easier. It will also transform industries like manufacturing and agriculture. Robots will be able to perform repetitive tasks quickly and efficiently, freeing up humans to focus on more creative endeavors. But with all the benefits that artificial intelligence brings, there are also concerns about its impact on society. As machines become more intelligent, they may replace human workers, leading to job loss and economic inequality. In March of 2023, more than 1,000 technologists and researchers signed an open letter calling for a six-month pause on the development of the largest AI models, citing concerns about an out-of-control race to develop and deploy ever more powerful digital minds. May 30, 2023, a statement released by Center for AI Safety, expressed the risk of extinction from AI should be a global priority alongside other societal scale risks, such as pandemics and nuclear war. The open letter was signed by more than 350 executives, researchers and engineers working in AI. These included top executives from three of the leading AI companies. Sam Altman, chief executive of OpenAI, Demis Hassabis, chief executive of Google DeepMind, and Dario Amade, chief executive of Anthropic. Jeffrey Hinton and Yoshua Bengio, two of the three researchers who won a Turing Award for their pioneering work on neural networks and are often considered godfathers of the modern AI movement, signed the statement, as did other prominent researchers in the field. The third Turing Award winner, Jan Le Kun, who leads Meta's AI research efforts, opposed the call for a pause in powerful AI development. Jeffrey Hinton has resigned from Google in May 2023 at the age of 75, warning the world of the potential threat AI possess saying that they are not more intelligent than humans right now, but soon they may be. Mr. Altman, Mr. Hasabis and Mr. Amade met with President Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris to talk about AI regulation. They called for cooperation among the leading AI makers, more technical research into large language models and the formation of an international AI safety organization, similar to the International Atomic Energy Agency, which seeks to control the use of nuclear weapons. Mr. Altman has also expressed support for rules that would require makers of large, cutting-edge AI models to register for a government-issued license. Some skeptics argue that AI technology is still too immature to pose an existential threat while others have argued that AI is improving so rapidly that it has already surpassed human-level performance in some areas, and that it will soon surpass it in others eliminating a major number of white-collar jobs. As we move forward with this technology, it's important that we consider the ethical implications of AI. We must ensure that it is developed and used in a way that benefits everyone. The future of artificial intelligence is both exciting and uncertain. But one thing is clear, we are on the cusp of a revolution that will change the world forever. If you liked this video, please click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon for more upcoming videos. Thank you for watching.